Well, hi guys, and welcome to RCC Adventures. Now, you can hear the quads is running because it's MOT day. Yeah, it's time to get his MOT, and then once he's got his MOT, it then can go up for sale. Um, yeah, so I'm not going to be able to film anything on the inside because me being a superb videographer, I forgot my mount. So there'll be no ink off which is today, I'm afraid. So you'll see when I get there, when I've dropped it off, like I have done in the past with other MOT videos, and then uh, the results after, and we'll go from there. Uh, by the end of this video, hopefully, it's got an OOT, and then it can go up for sale, and it'll be on eBay. Uh, it's more likely going to be an auction, there'll be a starting price, and probably a reserve. Uh, so don't expect it to be cheap. It's not going to be like 500 quid, or $500 if you're ever in America. And yeah, so uh, I'm running a little bit late, so we're going to get going. I need to get fuel, and uh, next scene I'll see you in the uh, when I've dropped it off. Right, okay, so the car is in. I'm not liking his chances really. Um, got here and the uh, near side front, so the passenger front, as we're on the right hand side, we drive on the right hand side of the car, uh, the near side front brake was dragging. So uh, I had a point in the petrol station, used their um, air and water machine to call the brake off. Um, but I'm not liking his chances. Uh, I thought I'd come up here to uh, try and get out of the rain, but. It being winter still, there's no leaves on the trees, so it's not really helping, but hey-ho. But anyway, the car's in. Drove up here faultlessly, apart from the brake. Um, didn't really notice anything untoward. I even went up some hills, didn't really notice much. And uh, so we'll see how it does. But there uh, might be another part to the MOT side of things. We'll see. Hopefully it's just an advisory, but you never know. So, uh, yeah, I'll, cap I'll uh, keep you up to date on what's happening. I've got a quite, probably quite a long wait, actually, because I thought it was 9 o'clock. It turns out it's actually 9.30, the MOT, so it's an extra half an hour on top. And the MOTs these days still only take an hour. So I'm going to be waiting around. Right, OK, as expected, it has failed. Uh, but not on things we expected it to be. I was expecting it to fail on the brake, and it didn't. Uh, it's not even as an advisory. Um, there are one, two, three. There's five advisories. Um, but two bits it failed on is an excessive engine oil leak, and um, the centre seat belt buckle at the rear is missing, which is a bit weird. But nice, easy fixes, really. And then it's got an MOT. So obviously I've got 14 days to do that. And uh, yeah, so we'll get this back and then uh, work will commence in a part two. And then uh, bringing it back to the MOT station to get its MOT. So yeah, I'm gonna leave it there guys. And uh, if you like what you see, please uh, subscribe and uh, give this video a like, comment and share it with your friends. And um, We'll catch you in the next one. So this is part one. Wait out for part two. And then there'll be part three when it goes up for sale. Cheers.